Welcome, my name is Nadine and I'm your Application and Admission Officer at the RWTH International Academy. In this How to Apply video tutorial, you will learn step by step how to submit your application for a master's degree program at the RWTH online application portal. Before we start, let's clarify who is the ideal candidate for a master in engineering or management in engineering and what is important for our selection process. We are welcoming your application if you have a bachelor degree in engineering, technology or science, practical work experience of at least 12 months, solid English language skills and a GRE score above 300. But always check our website for specific prerequisites for your desired master course. The following documents are mandatory and must be submitted in RWTH Online for a complete application. A transcript of records, a GRE scorecard, proof of work experience, an English language certificate, your CV, one letter of motivation, two letters of recommendation, our supplementary sheet and your bachelor degree certificate or a provisional certificate if the final degree is not yet available. All application documents must be issued in English or German. Please prepare these documents beforehand, since you must finish your application in one go and cannot save it and continue later. Submitting the application will take about 30 minutes. Now, let's talk about some documents in more detail. The GRE test. A sufficient GRE certificate must have the minimum scores of 145 in verbal reasoning, 160 in quantitative reasoning and 3 in analytical writing. Work experience. We are looking for young professionals with at least 12 months experience. However, when submitting your application, proof of only 6 months experience is mandatory followed by another six months until enrollment. We accept many forms of work experience, like internships, part-time work or student projects. English language certificate. Since all of our masters are English taught, you must have an English language certificate. Without proving your English skills, there will be no enrollment. Two letters of recommendation. We require two referrals, ideally coming from different sources, like your manager at work or professor at university. These recommendations must be issued on official letterhead, signed or stamped and merged into one PDF file. Supplementary sheet. As part of the application, you will be asked to submit a supplementary sheet containing additional personal and academic information which will support your application process. Now, let's start your application with a step-by-step -step instruction in our application portal RWTH Online. Before you can begin, you need to register in the online portal first and create an applicant account. Click on the highlighted link Registration for Applicants and you will be taken to the basic user form. Fill in your master data as well as account data and confirm. A control window will appear now. Please review your personal data carefully before submitting the registration. Please check your mailbox now for a confirmation email containing the link to activate your account. Also look into your spam or junk folder for it. After clicking on the activation link from this email, your personal email address has been verified. Click continue. Now you see a registration page with your given username. Please create your individual password and complete your registration. The following message will appear. Congratulations, you're ready to start your application in RWTH Online. By clicking on continue, you will be taken to your business card. From here, click on applications. You are now seeing the RWTH online application menu and can start submitting your master's application by selecting Enter New Application in the yellow operation box. 
Look out for the following message that will pop up right away. Click no here if you do not have a German degree. Then continue and select the start of the course. Select master program as type of studies followed by the degree program you want to apply for and make sure to choose one manual admission as your entrance semester. As form of studies select further training studies. In the next step you will be asked to provide your personal data. All yellow fields are mandatory. Once finished click continue. The page correspondence address comes up next. Fill out the address information. If your permanent home address and correspondence address is identical, check the box and continue. In the following step, you are asked about your higher education entrance qualification. This means your school leaving qualification, not your bachelor degree. From the three options listed here, be sure to select option 2. Because as an international applicant, you have a foreign higher education qualification. Fill out all yellow fields and continue. Now you need to provide details about your academic background. While clicking Add Degree Program, the section Added Academic Background will open. Please enter your university degree here. Complete the information about the semesters you studied, as well as your status. In the grade field, please enter your final GPA and the maximum grade possible according to your university's grading system. This is important for us to be able to divert your grade into the German system. Finish your input by clicking Save and Close. In the next following steps, you can now upload all required application documents as PDF files. The menu will guide you through the uploading process. Click on Choose File under New Document and upload the documents one after another. After each upload, click Continue. In the category Other Proof of Performance, you will be able to submit your English Language Certificate or extracurricular activities. The category supplementary sheet is special. This is an internal document we have uploaded in RWTH online for you to fill in. Download the supplementary sheet, fill in the requested information and save the file as PDF. Now upload your personal supplementary sheet to RWTH online using the same steps as with the previous documents. In the next step, you will be asked for the evidence of English language. Please select your individual English test certificate here. However, if you do not take an English test yet, do not worry. You have time until enrollment to submit the English certificate. After submitting all application documents, you will see an overview of your application. Please review your data thoroughly now. You will not be able to change your application afterwards. Confirm your information and click on Send when you are 100% sure everything is correct. Congratulations, you have successfully submitted your application for a master's program at RWTH International Academy. Check your mailbox for a confirmation email. We are processing all incoming applications as they come in. However, our evaluation process is very thorough. Your application will be reviewed formally and academically. This process can take a few weeks, but we aim to send out admission as early as possible. In the meantime, you can always check the status of your application in your RWTH online self-service. So let's take a closer look at this important tool in your RWTH online account. After logging into your account and clicking on Applications in the Study section, you will see your list of applications. After submission, the status of your application is indicated by a yellow question mark, meaning the application has been sent 
the application documents have not been checked yet. Once your application has been checked and everything is OK and complete, the application status will change to a green check mark. Should your application documents be incomplete, the status in your self-service will show the application documents have been checked. The form, however, in which they were provided is not entirely acceptable. This status is clearly marked with a red cross and you will be notified by email and must take action. Select the incomplete application from your list and click on the magnifying glass on the right hand side to open the self-service view for this application. Check the list for the document that is clearly marked with the red cross and click on the arrow left to it. Now upload a new document following the menu shown. Please note, you can only upload missing application documents within the regular application period after March 1st for non-EU applicants and July 15th for EU applicants, you will not be able to submit any documents. Your application will be incomplete and not processed further. Is your application complete and all mandatory documents are formally OK? Your application status will show a green check mark. Congratulations! All formal entry requirements are met and your application will now be forwarded for the academic review. This has been quite a lot of information, so if you wish to go through all these application steps again in your own time, please read the detailed RWTH online guide on our website. If you still have any more questions, please feel free to reach out to me anytime. We are really looking forward to receive your application and wishing you all the best of luck. Take your career to the next level and become an RWTH Aachen engineer with our bespoke master's degree programs.